Hey everybody, today in this Shopify tutorial, we're gonna learn how to create products with variants and apply different prices to certain variants if you so desire. So a variant would be, for example, if you are selling t-shirts and you have small, medium, large, extra large, etc., as sizes or colors, um, or if you are printing front or front and back, etc. We're gonna go to products and we are going to create a new product. And basically that product is going to be a t-shirt. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna very quickly create our product. This is a beautiful cotton t-shirt. I'm just doing that like that. I'm going to add a picture to it. Uh, I'm going to add this black t-shirt right here. Oops, sorry about that. Uh, chose the wrong file there. So we're going to add the plain black t-shirt as a picture. We're going to say that it's $19.99 for the t-shirt. Now what we need to do is we need to add our variants. We're going to scroll all the way down to the bottom. We're going to check off this product has multiple options like sizes or colors. And so we are going to have an option for size. And now in this box, in uh, separated by a comma, we're going to put our sizes. So we're going to put small, medium, large, X large, XX large. Okay, so there are our sizes. Now we're going to add another option for color. Okay, it already puts it in there for us. So we're going to put black, comma white, comma blue, comma red, comma green, comma yellow. Something like that. Whoops. Happy. Very helpful if I spelled it right. Now we're going to add another option. Okay, so we're going to add printing. Front back, front, and back. Okay, so if you're doing printed t-shirts, those would be your options. All right, we're going to save this product for now, the way it is. And once it saves, what we're going to do is we're going to preview that product so that you can see how it looks as it is. All right, so it's going to load up here. Seems to be a little bit slow today. I'm not quite sure why, but all right. So we're going to preview this product. I'm going to open the preview in a uh, in a new tab, if it'll let me. Don't know why it won't let me, but whatever. That's okay. There it goes anyway. And so now we have our short sleeved T-shirt. We've got our one picture that you can zoom in on, and now you can see we have our variations. There's our sizes, there's our color, and there's our printing. Now let's say that you wanted to, if it was going to be printed front and back with your logo or whatever your design was, let's say you wanted it to be $24.99 instead of $19.99 for that product. So we're going to go back to our we're going to close this tab. We're going to go back to our product. And here you can see as you scroll down, here's all our variants. All right. So small black front, small black back, etc., etc. All right. So what we want to do is we want to edit any front and back um, variants to be an extra cost. All right. So we're going to start with, there's a little bit of a pain here because you can't, so we're going to do, let's see, we're going to click on front and back. All right. And it's going to highlight all of them. And we're going to edit prices. Okay. Now, the, the good thing about it is that we don't have to go through this every color and every size combination. All we have to do is 
apply a price to all variants and say $24.99. We're going to apply to all. And now all of our products with front and back printing are $24.99. So we're going to click done. We're going to save that. And now we're going to preview it again. And this time when we preview it, we're going to select a color, a size, and a front and back and see if the price changes. So we're going to go to preview. All right, so let's say we need it in a large. We want it in blue. And we want printing front and back. And now you can see the price changes to $24.99. So that's how easy it is to add products with variants such as size, color, printing options, etc. to your Shopify store. And as you can see, we now can change the price of our product based on the variations chosen. So that will give you a lot of flexibility when you are creating your products, when those products have a variety of options available to the customer. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe, share these videos, like these videos, and check out my Patreon, patreon.com slash sgtech. Take care, guys. Thanks for watching.